a couple of weeks ago, the Loose Women revealed the very first results of their exclusive love survey. Well, today we're going to tackle more of the, the intimate issues affecting relationships, but, of course, this time it's going to be from a completely male perspective. Now, these figures fascinate me. A quarter of those polled really believe that flirting counts as cheating. And almost double the number of women think that flirting is cheating compared to men. You see, it takes two to flirt, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. It takes two to flirt, so that must mean that half of those responding were women, and therefore they're being hypocritical in admitting that they're cheating. I don't, I don't get it. How, how can flirting be cheating, Jordan? What do you think? I, I personally think it's where you draw the line mm. at flirting, or what constitutes flirting. To you. Let's say, I don't know, let's say me, me and Rob are having a conversation now and we're both laughing along and stuff like that. Someone will say, oh, to some people that's flirting. I could be like, no, it's just a conversation. But to other people, you know, being friendly, who knows? Like, for me, I kind of draw my rule at if I've got my fiance with me, nay, yeah. if I wouldn't do whatever I'm doing in front of her, then it's probably inappropriate. That's your rule of thumb. Flirt. That's a rule of thumb. All if right. I wouldn't do it with my partner there, then I wouldn't do it. All right. I was flirting. Just said that was my sex face. Right. right. <laughs> Thank you, Rob. Well, it, <laughs> well received. Thank you, Rob. Get Nay out, just in case. Get Nay out. But surely <laughs> flirting, as I understand it, flirting has to have, Martin, a degree of sexual content to it, doesn't it? Otherwise, it's not flirting. It's got oh, to be something to do it? with... No, I think we're all animals. I think we're all... <laughs> um, you know, I think I flirt with everyone. I think it's flirting with men and women is what you were saying. Um, I think what you have to look out for is keeping the respect for your partner. Right. Mm -hmm. And as soon as they lose that, then you lose respect for yourself, you know? And that's how I was brought up. You have mm -hmm. respect for everyone and everybody's things. And, um, you know, you have to keep that in mind. I think, I think I agree with your rule of thumb, that if, if you think that your partner, if they overheard this conversation that was going on, would be worried, offended, you know, put in the shade, then you, you're overstepping the mark. Yeah. What, what's your perspective but on there's this? There's so much dishonesty around this. If you're in a good quality, secure relationship, um, you should be able to flirt with anybody. It's not yeah. just about intention. It's not a thought crime. It's what, as is always the case in life, it's what you do, I think, that um, really matters. But is it cheating? Is it no, cheating I to think have a, a good quality relationship, um, you should be able to say you find somebody else attractive. And you should be able to delight in one another and feel safe enough to express that. I think that's probably a surefire way to stay together. My stepdad is still pining over Naomi Campbell, and my mum still finds it <laughs> utterly <laughs> hilarious. Um, it's never going to happen. But they I, th I think you're allowed to say, if that person there, they're attractive, yeah. as, nor as long as they're not really that attractive. <laughs> they're not too much. Yeah, are you not allowed? too much. No, no, hang on, but are you allowed to say to that person, when your par partner's not there, I find you very attractive? No. No, 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 no that's the difference. That's crossing the line. Yeah. Absolutely. But that's I have not, to say that's that the line for me and Judy was written absolutely in concrete, because, I mean, you know, when, when we got going on Rich and Judy, and, you know, this morning show before that, we were sort of emblem emblematic as, 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 as the nation's sort of married couple. Mm. We didn't seek it, but that's kind of what was delivered on us. And it would have been outrageous for either of us to, to be seen flirting with anybody. Mm. Just, it just wasn't mm -hmm. allowed, you know. So I think, I think that the standards apply to you as a person depending on your relationship. Mm. And you're right, there are some couples who are perfectly happy and they're almost flattered mm. if their partner's flirted with, don't you think? But aren't yeah. there new... Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. Okay. Aren't there new ways of flirting? I mean, now you could do it on social media, right? Mm. Um, oh. You can sort of accidentally... Double, double tap someone, double tap someone's picture. That'll catch you a whole load of grief. No, let's not even go <laughs> there. Don't, don't even start down <laughs> the that hole. The send button is the modern gate to hell. <laughs> yeah. Ah, did I press send? <laughs>